does, it does. Well, it's nice to go. Yeah, that's also what I'm... Right. Hmm? Circle. Hmm? Circle. Yeah. Oh. So, another one of the young males. I was telling you guys, they, you've got me with a name now. I never, I don't know what to say anymore about it. So, it's like I was saying, they give birth, and within 14 minutes yeah, of giving birth, running. the baby is up and yeah. running. Yeah. Not up and walking. He's yeah. up and running with the rest of the herd. You the rumbles. So there's a lot of communication that happens with elephants. If you look underneath, if they do cross over, I'll show you their track. Um, you'll see that there is veins underneath their feet, just like humans. Mm -hmm. And the way you tell is by looking at their tusks and see which tusk has been used the most. Nice. Now, if you have a look carefully, you can see both of his tusks have actually broken, especially this uh, left-handed one. It's broken mm -hmm. uh, uh, top and bottom. Rhino. So young, youngest bull. Mm -hmm. It looks like a bit of an experienced rhino. So. So of course this guy was right up front for for calls, uh, for, for colors. Yeah, they are very, very pretty and this one's not in the sun, it's pretty, but you can still see the colors. Left in the puff adder, to the point where I'm sure if you cut the skin open, that would um, kind of ambling around you, having a look. I might. Yellow birded, throated, throated, yellow throated sand clouds. blood on his face and then you can also see it's amazing that a baby would stand through mm. I mean size wise there's nothing this baby could really do to him I mean, he, he could do so much damage to this youngster, but he's actually being very good about it. What's this actually about? Mating. Where are you going now? It's also called a ibis. It's a brown ahina. We don't have spotted ahinas here. We have the brown ahina. So this is total nocturnal animal. In that brown area, Janet, towards that big clump of green trees. It's, it's going behind the trees. Yeah, yeah looking in the wrong area. It's over oh, they're lovely. He's <laughs> having a bit of a walk and a run. You're not going to have too many predators up and about at this time. 
the neck is actually on the opposite side, counterbalancing, and then vice versa as it walks. And I'll try and watch it as well. You'll actually see them swallow, and you'll see the cut ball go all the way down the long neck, and then you'll actually see it come all the way back up again, and then. Go with the age of a giraffe yeah. to tell if they're getting, they're very similar to humans. They go lighter in color. Okay. Is that anybody? I count eight. If they've got another pick up or drop off to do, they have got another. Bless you. Bless you. And another one? Bless you again. Oh, he's looking at me. He's watching the tire. He's looking for dinner. He's the boat. Mmm. So this is mother and calf. On your four, on your four, man, gate. These guys are noisy, sorry. Yeah. Oh, well. Luckily our gate was closed. You're all safe tonight. Luckily <laughs> the other lodges closed their gates as well. Guys, welcome back. I hope you enjoyed that. Fantastic, thank you. Thank you. Make sure that I close the gate again. Okay. <laughs> 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 She's quiet, she's listening.